It's renowned as a great surf spot, but now Strand Hill will be an even bigger draw because it's home to the first national surf centre with top class facilities. There are great clubs doing great work around the country that have been involved in surfing for a you know, number of years, but now we have a presence, we have a facility here, a base for the surfing community. So that can be used not only just for the local um, surfers and domestic and international surfers who come or will come here, but also training facilities here and um, what how we can work with the organizations like Irish Surfing to bring in national and international events. Well the new National Surf Centre it'll be like the Crow Park of Surf in Ireland. It'll facilitate athletes from right up to the highest level right down to your basic beginner surfer. Surfers are great to get changed out of the back of a car in the middle of winter, but we have nice dry change rooms and warm showers for our customers and for the surf club coming in and for any of the surf visitors who will be visiting Strand Hill this summer. So this is a luxury. We're, we're moving up in the world. <laughs> Officially opened by not one but two ministers, Catherine Martin and Heather Humphreys, the centre is a long-held dream of the local community and it's expected to significantly boost tourism here. So a centre like this, we expect to get about 50,000 visitors here to Strand Hill by 2030, 2033, which is phenomenal. And that means more and more businesses will set up and that means the community will be thriving. Yeah, it's great to have a focal point because you have like things like video analysis for surfers, just even a place for, for young people to talk about surfing, what they're doing on their waves, etc. Um, to have one place where they can gather. And I think that will be, it'll be a living, breathing centre where, where young people in this community and visitors can, can hang out and just kind of share the ocean and their experiences of it. Eileen Magner, RTE News, Strand Hill, County Sligo.